Alright, that should be recording. Um, hi guys, Monster Cameron here again for Think Teletronics. And um, not much of a vlog update today. I just wanted to make a couple uh, channel updates. So last night I created a real leak video. It's a Xenotic me and Kevin were playing uh, on a bunch of empty servers. Uh, great game, awesome. You should try it out and probably populate some of those empty servers. And also, the new update for Tomes of Mephistopheles 0.09 is out, so you can go pick that up uh, via their eShop at Caught in Action or um, via Desura, although the Win32 binaries might give you issues. Although, um, one of the developers said they would be uh, recompiling and uploading the Win32 binaries to Desura, so by the time you pick it up, it probably should be fixed. Um, but also, this leads me to a uh, a conclusion that I love Dark Places. Uh, Dark Places is an open source um, fork of the uh, Quake 1 engine, um, heavily, heavily, heavily enhanced and modified. Um, it's awesome, and you probably saw the video Action Quake with Dark Places via the Epsilon Pack. Uh, long name I know, but it was updated textures, bump mapping, all the works to make Quake look like a boss, like a modern, um, a modern uh, game, pretty much. And um, yeah, Dark Places is awesome. You guys should try it out. And you know what? It's completely free. The Quake, um, Quake stuff might be copyright uh, protected. Uh, you might have to purchase Quake. You can do that via Steam or maybe via its website, uh, and you can get the pack uh, data from them. But uh, otherwise, the engine is completely open source and and uh, GPL too. So uh, it should be fun. Um, yeah, and it's, it's real awesome sauce guys, so uh, check it out, and uh, I'll be posting a Tomes update video with uh, 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 later um, today or tomorrow, so uh, watch out for that guys, so yeah, peace.